Adam Sos here for Rebel News, and throughout these elections, we have heard stories of signs being stolen, even literature going missing at doors, and we understand it. Sometimes kids can do this, sometimes even some volunteers on campaigns can get involved in some of that dirty politics. But what if an MP, an elected MP who ran in this election and won, was caught doing it? Well, troubling footage emerged just last night of George Shahal doing exactly that. He approached a door, took off campaign literature of his conservative opponent in the race and replaced it with his own. Now, he and his campaign have stated that there was incorrect polling information and that's why they removed it. We don't know if that's true or not, but regardless, you do not remove other campaigns' campaign literature. That's simply not the way that it works. You can call Elections Canada, let that candidate know. But what this amounts to is theft, and it amounts to interference in an election. And actions must be taken both by Elections Canada and, in my opinion, the Calgary Police to counteract this. Well, there you have it. You can see it with your own eyes. We will be following up with our legal team to see what kind of action can be taken to address both this theft and this interference with a fair election process. And we're certainly going to keep you posted if we have any success on that front. I want to thank you all for tuning in. For Rebel News, I'm Adam Sos. The election may have come and gone, but that doesn't mean that election stories are behind us. We're going to continue following up on important stories like these. And if you want to support that work, you can do so at realreporters.ca.